Hello and welcome to Digit. In this video, we are going to show you how you can install the Crucial Basics DDR4 MHz UDIM memory stick onto a compatible motherboard. Now first, you should check the motherboard's QBL list or compatibility list in order to understand whether the module that you've purchased or you wish to purchase is compatible or not. In this case, we've already done that. And for us, this is going to be a simple installation. We've got four DIMM slots. When you read the motherboard manual, you'll understand the sequence in which you need to populate the RAM slots. Now, the convention is to populate the outermost slot first, that is outermost from the processor, followed by the alternative slot, followed by this slot, which is the second outermost slot, and lastly, the innermost slot. Now, in this case, we are only going to be installing one memory stick. So that will be going into the outermost slot. Now, there are different types of locking mechanisms for the RAM slots. In this case, we have an open slot on one end and a locking tab on the other. So in this case, you need to open up the locking tab, take the memory stick, next, figure out whether you're holding it properly or not. This is simple because all you need to do is look at the notch and align it with the notch, which is marked in silver over here. Now, in our case, the notch is not matching, in which case we're holding it upside down. So we'll just need to flip it. And now you can see that the notch is matching the notch on the slot. Next, because we have no locking tabs on the bottom and only on the top, we are going to insert it bottom first and then insert the top end. Slowly let it fall into place and then take two fingers or two thumbs, place one on the bottom edge, one on the top edge and apply pressure uniformly and push it down. You heard a little click that was the memory stick actually locking into place and the locking tab coming up to secure it. Now, in case of slots where you only have a locking tab on the top, you would be applying a little extra pressure to ensure that the bottom edge goes in first and then the top edge goes in, not the other way around. You wouldn't want to lock the tab first and then try to push it in. Just for repetition's sake, we'll show it to you again. Align the notch, insert the bottom edge first, followed by the top edge. Place two thumbs or two fingers, push the bottom edge a little further down than the top edge. You heard two clicks. One was the bottom edge and the other the top edge. Now you secure the memory in place and you're done. So that was how you could install the Crucial Basics DDR4 MHz memory stick into a compatible motherboard. Thank you for watching.